free music exploration and 70% off on subscriptions. That's what we are offering you today. Plus, learn how to make race day edits. Most of you ask that where do we get our music for videos, so we got an offer for you. The platform is called Audio, and it's totally free to explore. When you decide to purchase a subscription, you can click on our link in the description and use the code CREATIVE70 to get 70% off on your purchase. So let's start editing the video. And you know the first step, yeah, it's the arrangement of different assets into folders. Next, add your music to the timeline. We are trimming this music to 30 seconds to not make the video long. Now, the main technique to use music, and that's adding beats. After that, now import the footages one by one and arrange them on the timeline. The first part of the edit is usually the intro of our subject, in this case, which is a car. We are importing some shots from the static shots folder, and they will set up the intro for our video. How good the scene change looks when it is synced with beats. Now we have some shots in which our star is working on the modification of the car. Let's import and organize these footages. This scene will last till the beat drop and we will move to the racing track. Let's add some effects here and in the start. For this position, we are choosing Ripples Clear, which is a pro effect, and you can activate your pro cap cut from the link in the description. Now let's add the next footages, which are for the racing track. Here we will keep every shot for three beats and change the scenes. Now we will add inside car footage and create a cool reverse effect. To create this reverse effect, we will copy this footage and paste it again on the timeline. Now from this reverse button, we will reverse the clip and your reverse effect is ready. Now, in the same way, we will keep on adding the new footages and match them with beats. Just quickly go through the steps as we create this race day edit. Lastly, we are ending this edit with a nighttime shot to complete the storyline of Race Day. Now time for adding more effects where necessary. This is a CTV camera recorded shot, so we will search and add that effect. Remaining effects can be added by looking at the footages. Finally, we will add a title and for this, we will use the text behind the subject effect. Select the clips and create a copy. Now select the clip and click on Auto Cutout. We will quickly add our text layers between these clips, select font and do size corrections.
Following the same workflow, you can edit any type of short films, dynamic videos, and many more. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more. Stay tuned for our next video. And until then, take care.